Hello, my name is Fox, and you're watching Den of Fools. Let's jump right in. In week 17 of 2023, we had 79 tournaments, with a total of 1,678 players and 6,526 games played. This week, Space Marines topped the charts with 15 wins and 49 top 3 places. They have a weighted placing of 21.1, which is the highest in the blue group. Chaos Demons and Custodies get 7 wins, being ranked by the number of top 3 places. They both have a similar weighted placing, with the Custodies just doing better on 15.3 compared to Demons on 15.9. The Astro Militarum are the last faction in blue, with 6 wins and a weighted placing of 18.8. .8. This week, no faction has a weighted placing below 10, with Chaos Knights getting the best weighted placing with 11.5. All 25 factions manage at least one top 10 placing, with the Space Marines getting the most top 10s with 149. The Astra Militarum come next with 57, followed by Chaos Demons with 50 top 10 placings. Unsurprisingly, the Space Marines are the most played faction with 18.89% of players taking them. They have seen a further slight decrease from last week. Astra Militarum are the second most popular faction on 6.73%, followed by Chaos Demons who are on 6.62%. Chaos Demons have been a consistently popular faction for a while, so it is not surprising they have moved into third. The Custodies are back in fourth, regaining a significant portion of their popularity. Tau, who were previously third, have dropped to fifth, but their popularity has only decreased slightly. It looks like the third most popular spot is up for grabs again. It takes our resident stat guru and Ultramarine fanboy, Phyllis Fox, many hours to collect all the data. It would be great if you could show your appreciation by liking the video. It really helps us with the god algorithm of YouTube. We have grouped the win rates by colour, with the key at the bottom of the screen. This week, the third most popular faction, Chaos Demons, topped the win rate with an impressive win rate of 60%. Chaos Demons are looking like the faction to beat at the moment. The Inari are top of green, getting a significantly better win rate than last week with 55.6%. The second most popular faction, Astra Militarum, are next with a win rate of 54.7%, an improvement on last week. Custodies get a win rate of 53.2%, narrowly beating out the World Eaters, who got a win rate of 53.1%. The Orcs get a win rate of 51.1%, with the two Chaos Mix players getting a 50% win rate. The most popular faction, Space Marines, get a win rate of 48.9%. We will see how the individual chapters are doing later on in the video. The Tyranids, who had a significant rise in their win rate last week, dropped back down to 40.8% from their win rate of 46.1% last week. This win rate is more akin to their pre data slate win rate in the low 40%, so perhaps they just had a good week last time. The Genius Dealer Cults are at the bottom of yellow, with a win rate of 40%, Looks like the change to their secondary may well have affected their winning potential after all. The Thousand Sons are still in red, with a win rate of 38.1%, although they are no longer at the bottom of the pile. Sisters and Grey Knights both come after them, getting a win rate of 37.2% and 33% respectively. It looks like it was a bad week for these two factions, as they generally perform significantly better. With the second week of balanced data slate results and some interesting weekly win rates, there has been some movement on the Arcs of Omen rankings. Chaos Demons take over at the top, with a win rate of 55.1%. The Gene Zelicals drop down to second, with a win rate of 54.7%. It'll be interesting to see if they continue to drop down the rankings. The World Eaters are still in third, with a win rate of 53.5%, but they are closing in on second position. After a return to form, the Inari move back up to fourth, with a win rate of 53.3%. The second most popular faction, Astra Militarum, move up to fifth, with a win rate of 52.6% tied with the Leagues of Votan. The Orcs come next with a win rate of 52.2%, overtaking the third most popular faction Custodies, who get a win rate of 51.8%. The most popular faction Space Marines are on a win rate of 49.3%. There are some slight changes in the midfield, with a few factions trading positions. The Tower have overtaken the Death Guard, and the Grey Knights have dropped down three places after their poor week. There are six chapters with only a single player, but as they were only one, this week, the White Scars topped the win rates with 55.6%, a very good week for them. The six Death Watch players are next, with a win rate of 54.5%. Although they were only six players, it looks like they are really enjoying the changes GW made in its recent data slate. The third most popular chapter, the Iron Hands, are still performing well, with a win rate of 53.8%, and significantly more players than the chapters above them. The Salamanders get a win rate of 52.4%, followed by the Blood Angels, with a win rate of 51%. The most popular chapter, the Space Wolves, are top of yellow, with a win rate of 48.1%. The second most popular chapter, the Dark Angels, get a win rate of 47.8%, a significant drop for them. It looks like the balanced data slate changes have finally caught up to them. It will be interesting to see if they continue to get a win rate below 50%. The Black Templars get a win rate of 47.4%, 
followed by Phyllis's favourite blue boys, the Ultramarines, with a win rate of 41.5%. The most popular chapter, the Dark Angels, are narrowly still on top, with a win rate of 56.1%. The second most popular, the Iron Hands, are next, with a win rate of 56%. It looks like the Iron Hands may well overtake the Dark Angels sooner than expected. They are followed by the third most popular chapter, the Space Wolves, with a win rate of 50.6%. There are a further four chapters with over 200 players, with the Black Templars getting a win rate of 46.4%. The Salamanders get a win rate of 45.7%, followed by the Blood Angels, on a win rate of 42.8%. They have overtaken the Ultramarines, who are now on a win rate of 42.6%. It will be interesting to see which one finishes higher, my favourite the Blood Angels, or Fearless's favourite the Ultramarines. This week, only one of the known legions have more than 10 players, so we will go straight into arc so far. The most popular, the Black Legion, topped the win rates with 43%. They are followed by the 75 Alpha Legion players, on a win rate of 40.2%. The 77 Iron Warriors players, and second most popular legion, the Empress Children, both have a win rate of 38.8%. The 28 Red Corsairs players are on a win rate of 36.4%, with the 59 Night Lords players on a win rate of 34.8%. I'm sure Chaos Space Marine players are excited to see the 10th edition rule preview which is coming this week. If you enjoyed our content please subscribe, check out one of the videos on screen and consider using our affiliate links in the description. Thank you for watching.